Yeah, yeah, basically telling the man same ugly. Honestly. She basically looking at her own man when she sleep with every night and I tell him him ugly. <laughs> welcome back to my channel. So guys, welcome back to my channel. I was here talking, talking, didn't know the video was recording. So I am going to give you guys my honest review on this video i just watched i just want to give you a review because i watched it and i was I, so i have a set of youtubers that i watch like yeah they're like my favorite it's like dk gang that's their ranking nk gang nikki and clan gk gang G, geo and ken and um carter family twia niche rosa and chrissy and other people like Rolly and Trish and um, Reza and um, Ianja. So yeah, I watch those and I watch other YouTubers like um, Risa, Risa and Kwan. I watch those people too and some other people. But I was watching a video where Rosa and I think Rosa was the one pranking um, Chrissy. Let me go on it. So Rosa pranked her that he believes that their daughter Paris isn't his child. No, everybody know Paris looks at Rosa, so it was funny to watch because it was not like like the child the child looks like him. The chubby cheeks, the idea is him, that's his baby, right? So that's not what made me this time I do the video. What made me decide I'm going to do the video is the way she responded. And her response wasn't like out of the normal where she was saying, of course, it's a little bit like she did a general man response. That was fine. But then she started saying something and I'm going to let you guys watch it and see if you guys don't get that like me. Because I was like, what? what? So... So I'm going on it right now. Turn it because the Wi Fi is up. I have to turn this way to the day. So I'm not gonna watch the full video because um I watched it already, so I'm gonna let you guys um watch it on their channel. Um, but I'm gonna show you what I observed. It's a peaceful day, don't bother. It's a days, days. It's a peaceful day, don't bother. It's a days, days. It's a peaceful day, don't bother. It's a days, days. It's a peaceful day, don't bother. It's a days, days. It's a peaceful day, don't bother. It's a and him come now but the baby don't look like him. That does weird. Where him come from with that? That no. I know me to do this right now. I'm not feeling like there is okay because the baby look like him. It's just weird. And then five years and I know baby born no longer than five years he wanted the anything. So what that? What that? But it's a prank. But I get a reaction. Because of me. Because of me. Because of me. That's the only one problem. Because of me, if the tongue got to me, no, like, why? That, that, never like that. And, and if I just, just there, if she just had said it there, and she, do, she didn't continue like that, but she's going to tell him why he should be thankful that she's with him. And it is, uh, that means there's something wrong with how he looks to her. So she don't feel about you? Come on. Me, me a did any. If you feel a bad, Rosa. Em, 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 feel bad. Alright, you know what? Oh, yeah, so we did. He's a child. If you feel a bad, Rosa. If you feel a bad. So he is not entitled to do a DNA test on her child. Which I get why she upset, why she said if you feel a bad, do it but I'm just giving her the demeanor that she has because she feels that 
she is a prize and he got the prize and there's nothing wrong to feel like you're the prize in a relationship you're confident but to the level where you're gonna tell a person that you're the prize because of your appearance that is you get what I'm, i don't know if people get what i'm saying appearance should not if you're in a relationship your appearance should not be the factor of the relationship yes it matters to an extent but if solely you and if if you are the one that is bragging about your appearance it's kind of vain you know like if you look good you come out and you're like oh i look good I look, that's that's not a you know but like if somebody is saying that's a different like you allow people to compliment you that's genuine you know but nothing is wrong to be confident you know but at the price of what you're being confident at the price of belittling your spouse you get him? but and then why would you be with someone if you don't think they are as attractive as you are they're not attractive enough for you because you're gonna say you should thank god that is like a big thing you know for saying you should thank god that means you have gotten a lucky chance an ultimate prize an ultimate favor and what is the favor because she's gonna tell you guys the favor though hold on so wait, oh, so wait, 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 Nice hair is straight Indian or straight looking Caucasian looking type of hair. Nice hair is not nappy black hair. Well, somebody's a wee, but yeah, my natural hair is actually similar to the texture. But yeah, nappy black hair is not nice hair, right? Black coily hair is not nice hair. Me like my nappy head. I like my nappy <laughs> afro. No, honestly, when I watch it, I was like, wait there, because, and him, and the way, oh, he sat there, and he took it like, try it, like, this is not, so my spouse telling me I am, quote, but she basically telling the man, say, ugly, honestly, she basically looking at her own man when she sleep with every night, and I tell him him ugly. Why? Why would I? Not even if I can make you watch more video because just thinking of it, it is just embarrassing for black men to always subject themselves to this. Why subject yourself to be with somebody that is going to belittle you, going to tell you that your black features, your beautiful African feature, the broad nose, the thick lips, are the, the, the nice chocolate skin tone, the mocha skin tone is ugly is unattractive and because they are caramel or they're light skin or they're white skin and they have white features or they have indian features and they have li little to none african features they are pretty and they are prized why and then you go to the extra mile when you have to reproduce with these faces it's like oh god thank god my ch my child isn't black like me where is the self-love how oh, could I know? See, but I don't, I'm not gonna do any more review on it. You guys don't have to watch it. How oh, could I know? Sleep with a man, and I'm going to look at my man that I am sleeping with every night for five or six years. I think just for six years. For all those years, and then you're gonna turn to him and tell him that, thank God, thank God. I'm not bashing them. I love their videos, but I've noticed the demeanor from ever since where. She always act like you're lucky you get me here, you know. Like it's not like I love you, I appreciate you, and I know that you love me. Yeah. Themselves on the internet, it's like Rosa get an Indian girl with him ugly black self. Honestly, that's all it is like. All this ugly black man, and it is disgusting. I personally, I, my children' father is a black man. I am a black woman. My children' father, he has a broad features, the black broad nose. He doesn't really have thick lips. I'm the one with the thick um, African lips, the thick lips, you know. And I don't find myself ugly. I don't find my my children' father ugly. I am a little more 
it's a little more darker than me in skin tone and I find it oh, completely attractive. I used to look at him and I used to tell him, oh, beautiful, how oh, sexy, oh, beautiful, his color is, I don't know. And it, and it's just so sad to know that they just don't, no matter how much you tell people how oh, beautiful they are, they don't love themselves and they subject, they subject themselves to these situations. Like, you put yourself below another person uh, because of your own race, your own features. Like if, and there should be nothing in life that you should make another person or look at another person better than no matter the no matter if the president no matter the respect you can respect a person for their stature, but you should never lower yourself or look at yourself as if you could never be like them or you are beneath them because of their stature. That's what I'm trying to say. So always align ourselves in whatever opportunity, whatever field. We want to, we can always achieve what another person achieves. So I don't even know how people bad mind people because I could not. Anything someone has, I can put apply myself and achieve. But if you are with somebody and you, if they're going to turn to you and like, oh, you should thankful. It's not. Sometimes we're in a relationship and it's all cute to see a man go all over his woman. It's very cute to see a, a man and those that he recognizes his woman. Is beautiful and adore her, admire her, um, praise her. It's nice, it's beautiful. But we should always, as a human being, reflect and check if our relationship that we are in is one sided. Um, a lot of times, love turns turns out one sided. It it might be the person like you more first, and then gradually you are you have always been the one chasing that person. But there must be a time when you're gonna realize that's not it. That's not it. It's not. It. It's not okay for anybody to look at somebody that they're sleeping with every night and tell them that. So the pitney don't look like you. If you're glad the pitney. The pitney resemble you, but if you're glad I mean, see if the pitney can shit. If the pitney was 100, basically, that's how I get. I don't know if I'm really into it too deep, but that's how I get. It's like she basically telling the man that if the baby, if their child looked 100% like him, she'll be ugly because he's ugly. And if you're glad him get her. And honestly, I think maybe him himself think that he's ugly, and that's the bad, the worst part. The self eat when many black men. Have in is like black men they got they're going to need some therapy because it's self it was some a lot of black men especially Jamaican black men have them walk around and them just flash and they act confident you know and they will look any girl you know but trust I believe in the confidence you know I try them I try them look them really and truly they really and truly um don't think they are worth um certain girls because they feel like their features aren't the social acceptable features they feel like their black features are ugly and then especially them dark skin and then you know, when they get a girl that um have the social accept acceptable features the european or the mixed look the, the it's like them get a prize and i realize that i any time you put yourself in a relationship you should always Look at yourself like, I am something of value, not just my partner. Regardless of how my partner looks, regardless of how I look, and honest to me, Rosa is a good-looking black man. There's nothing wrong with it. I don't know why would anybody subject themselves to that type of treatment. She never even said it once. She said both three times. And not like, oh, like we have to be better than... And, and women, I understand... Everybody prays certain attributes, certain features, certain... You understand the long ear where everybody are by? She have it naturally. Well, not everybody, where most black women buy, I wear them too. Um, the, the light skin with the Jamaica man, they kill off themselves and, and kill all the girl them for. But look into it. When, when you're being with somebody, if you're going to be with somebody because you want to be praised, beauty is not something that lasts forever there has to be something substantial you understand what i'm saying there has to be something substantial so no no other ties to it oh my love him because he was dead for me but no there should be no i love him for him 
You understand? And a lot of people walk away from people loving for him because they are looking at looks and they're looking at shape and they're not looking at the real thing. And enough people, a lot of men and women are in relationship with people that they are only in it for certain things. Because let me tell you, so the things that we are in relationship with are vain, when they fade away, hope that they really love each other genuinely and honestly. And I hope that she was just saying it to him because she was upset. Because if not, that not look good and it never sound good. Thank <laughs> you.